Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck have finally tied the knot after leaping over many obstacles over the years. The couple, who rekindled their romance last year, have said their idos in Nevada over the weekend, according to TMZ. Their reconciliation came as a shock to the world when they took another shot at their romance in April last year. Since then, they have been inseparable, with Ben getting down on one knee a year later. However, there was a failed engagement and many different relationships in between before JLO and Ben got to where they are now. First time meeting the iconic 90s duo met in 2002 on the set of their film Gili. At the time, the Get Right singer was married to her second husband, Chris Judd. Ben heavily hinted at his love for Jennifer when he took out a full-page ad in trade magazines, gushing to her, It has been nothing but an honor and a pleasure to work with you. I only wish I were lucky enough to be in all your movies. With love, respect, and gratitude, Ben Affleck, the same year, Jennifer divorced Chris and was spotted canoodling with Ben at his surprise birthday party as well as on a road trip in a Bentley. Ben then appeared in JLOS music video for Jenny from the block where they played themselves, acting out their relationship as seen from paparazzi shots. Failed engagement Ben proposed to JLO the same year they met on set. He proposed with a 6.1 carat pink diamond ring worth two million pounds. Speaking to Diane Sawyer, Jennifer discussed the romantic moment. It's just a blanket, a quilt of rose petals, all over the whole entire house, she recalled. So many candles, and vases, bouquets. And my song Glad was playing. I walk in, and I was just overwhelmed. I wasn't expecting it, and I was just like, oh my god. I had cried a lot over sadness over the years, and for the first time in my life, I cried incredible purging tears of happiness. It was the most cleansing feeling and the most wonderful feeling I had ever had. In September 2003, one day before the wedding, Benifer delayed the ceremony, citing the media scrutiny. However, just four months later, at the beginning of 2004, they announced they decided to go their separate ways. New relationships after splitting from Ben, she went on to tie the knot with Mark Antony that same year. However, their marriage didn't last and the duo split in 2011. She shares twins with Mark, named Max and Emma, who are both 13. Their divorce was finalized in June 2014. Jennifer said their wedding, which was only several months after her split from Ben, was a band-aid on the cut and recalled a rocky start to the marriage. She had an on-off relationship with her former backup dancer Casper Smart from October 2011 to 2016, before getting into a serious relationship with Alex Rodriguez. The pair got engaged and even delayed their wedding twice due to the pandemic. Unfortunately, they admitted in March 2021 that they were working through some things and split one month later. Meanwhile, Ben and Jennifer Garner started a friendship on the sets of Pearl Harbor and Daredevil. They tied the knot in 2005 in a private ceremony in Turks and Caicos. The pair, who share children Violet, 16, Serafina, 13, and Sam, 10, were together until 2018. He went on to have a brief romance with actress Anna de Armas followed by an ill-fated stint on celebrity dating Apria. Get all the biggest showbiz news straight to your inbox. Sign up for the free Mirror Showbiz Newsletter.
Reunion after a hard couple of years with a pandemic shutting down the world, Jennifer and Ben rekindled their romance. It wasn't long before they were spotted house hunting together and getting back to how things were all those decades ago. The couple, reported by us to be very happy together, confirmed they were officially engaged in April 2022. And now, according to TMZ, the couple got married after obtaining a marriage license in Clark County, Nevada. A source close to the happy couple confirmed to the site that they got married over the weekend. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at Web Celebs at Mirror. Co.uk or call us direct at 0207 29